Okay, power steering is in. Sorry I didn't record the installation, but uh, I installed the column. Everything is functional and operational, but it's not finalized. I've got to button everything down and lock tight and tighten everything for the final final installation, but uh, let's show you right here. So this is no power steering. You can kind of hear how hard it is. If we turn the key on. Now you can see one finger much, much easier. So it is working. I got the steering wheel straight, took it for a little test drive, but uh, you can see I have the wheel. There is the column. There is the motor with my mangled mess that attaches the column to the motor. And then from there we go through all the joints, through the firewall. Let's see if I can get you up in there. There is the firewall bearing. I do need to tighten that down, but uh, everything is operational. I mounted the, uh, I can show you that, the uh, control box is over there. And there's two wires that go from the control box to the motor. Uh, the little black box on top is the adjustable knob. Uh, I, for my setup, I've got it all the way up, so uh, I like a, uh, you can adjust it to as less, like it's basically off, or crank it all the way up. I haven't cranked all the way up because it's it's much easier. Still, I thought it was going to be easier than, than it would at full power, but uh, it'll definitely do the job. And then from there, there's, uh, you know, trigger wires going over to my fuse panel. So, uh, and then we have that large cable. That large red cable comes straight from the battery, so that's the power source straight from the battery into the controller there's a relay inside and computer controls everything so that is hot all the time and then it only gives power to the motor uh, when it when the key is on and it's activated so let's take you to the engine compartment here and that's what we have here let's see if I can get you down in there but we have other side of the firewall bearing. It looks like I need to seal that up. Probably could have done a much better job uh, with that piece of metal. I might redo it, but uh, it's working for now. And then we've got the steering joint and then that one bolts straight into, uh, into the steering box. So, all right. Like I said earlier in the earlier video, definitely don't use the collar that I used uh, and make your life a lot easier. Thanks for watching.